twins. They're as close as two different people can be. But twins that don't get on can be double trouble. My guests today say they're sick of the sight of their other half. Twin, you're a copycat. Back off and get your own life. Today's Vanessa. show twins we're told look the same react the same think the same but today we're talking to twins who definitely are not the same my first guest knows this problem all too well she married a twin and says it's like being married to two men at once Dan's her man but she got Dave his terrible twin as well let's welcome Linda <laughs> together when you met them yes well before I can say anything you know they they are a nightmare it is an absolute nightmare you know were they dressed the same that very first um, night? yes actually they were yes when I, when I fe first met um, Dan yes yes they were both wearing the same they were Dave wasn't with him at the time you know, um, he walked away and then uh, you know we, we were together and I didn't didn't realize after that you know uh, after you know, we were going out, and then he was there always on the scene. I didn't realise what I was getting myself in, into. So basically, Dave was just part of the package. Wherever Dan was, That's Dave right, was. That's right, yeah. This yeah. applied to dates? Oh, yeah, yes, it was, yes. Yes, he suddenly, you know, up here, yeah. Well, it also applied to your wedding, didn't it? I know, yes, yes. My, my, my family you just couldn't believe it, you know, when we're having the photos taken, and it got to having the cake cut. Um, all of a sudden, there was Dave. He just appeared, you know. <laughs> on the cake cut. There he was, actually. Had his hand on the knife, you know, cutting the cake as well. Did he want to walk up the aisle with you too? Uh, not quite, no. No, <laughs> so he didn't. He was no. there in the pictures. He was there cutting the cake. Yes. And then it came time for the romantic honeymoon. Yeah, that's right. Yes. Where did Dave feel he should be? Yes, yes. We, we, yeah, we had a, a honeymoon and everything, and uh, he just really thought that he should be coming as well. You know, so it was just... Uh, you know, it's crazy. People just don't, don't understand, you know. He d didn't want to be left out. He'd just uh, always been with Dan, you know, and uh, he just thought... I mean, he, he's, he's married as well, you know, but he, he just always, always together. They'd rather be together than with their wives, I think. Did you ever actually fancy Dave? No, not at all. I don't, this might sound strange, you know. It does sound strange, because um, they're completely identical. Them. Yes, they're identical, but they are different, uh, totally different. I, th I think, you know, personalities. I mean, in the know. end, you were forced to move 200 miles away from Dave. Yes, well, we had, well, yeah, that, I think um, that was the only answer because um, we were, you know, we lived everywhere we lived. Um, Dave was always popping round. We couldn't get on with our own life, you know. It was really, you know, ridiculous. I, I mean, mean, you'd invite uh, people for a dinner party, for example. Yes, yeah, so I had, um, we had friends round and uh, all together, and then all of a sudden, um, Dave would just turn up, you know, and I mean, <laughs> he just wouldn't, he wouldn't... Uh, Take the hint. It's what do you want to say to Dave today? Why have you come? What do you want to say to him? Well, I've, I've, I've just uh, just had had enough of it, really. You know, um, that's what you know. Get get away, and we've got to get on with our own married life. And um, so you'd like him to back off a bit? Well, I would really. All yeah, right, I the mean, twins have been listening yeah. backstage. Let's see yeah. what they've got to say. Let's welcome Linda's other half, Dan, and his other half, Dave. <laughs> I wrote a song on the way down. I, I wrote, wrote it and all. <laughs> He's just picked it up immediately. He does lips everywhere he goes. But he does interfere. Have you noticed? No, See, I not. sing a song and you still want to sing it with you. He sings it along with me. Let me ask, Dan, Dan, let me ask. Are you the better looking and more talented twin? Well, I didn't realise till Linda told me. And I looked in the mirror and the rear being tree. Can't you see? Be honest, look. <laughs> I even stand better. <laughs> don't be silly. Well, he does, actually. He does, actually. Dave? No, he, the trouble is with Dave. I mean, it's all right now. We're... we're we haven't, I haven't seen him for quite a time. So a last while. week, when, the, when we realised something was wrong, what actually happened was <laughs> your, your uh, colleagues rung Dave up, and I tried to ring. It was just uncanny. And I said, Linda, I'm off. Oh, not again, she said. So I jumped in the car, 
I rushed down to Boston. I got quite excited. 200 miles from Eastbourne. Rang and I thought, well, what are we going to do? I didn't know. I said, well, can, can you ring Dan up? So They uh, rang me up. The guy rang Dan up. And he he's said, on he's the answering machine. Phone. I, I think, said, well, I think well, he'll be on his way down because I'm in trouble, you see. I got down there. I said, what the hell is the trouble? And he said to me, quick, 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 he said. It's like a stereo. God totally He said, I want us on this tram program. I said, well. I don't know what you're talking about. You should be quiet. Lisa, do you find this happening all the time? Time. Yes, I mean, I've, I'm probably, you know, I've got used to it now after after a while and everything. She's very understanding, she's very good. Yeah, but, but Dave, uh, you see, if we're yeah, having an argument, just... instead of just sitting quiet and making the tea, which we like them to do when we're arguing, I mean, if, they, if she yeah. interferes when we're arguing, well, it's just, I have to attack her because if I don't, Dave would think I'm picking on him. I'm always <laughs> picking on him. Is anybody well, a is, twin yeah. in here at all? I think this yeah. gentleman is. You a twin? Stand up yeah. to the other twin, please. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Well, you have to come to a karaoke yeah. one night. How do you feel about him sort of being with you all the time? I mean, it, um, she's really sort of fed up with it. Yeah. I mean, uh, don't well, you I ever do tell him to clear off or anything like well, that? Well, no, I think we just sit there and all of a sudden you talk about something. It's mm. absolutely ridiculous. If a big thing comes along, we're there and I'll, if he had a bit of trouble, I'd Little say, thing hang on, we work it out. We've got to work it out and we've yeah, sorted we are, all that. We argue about nothing. Just a minute, really. Dave. <laughs> 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 he wants to be the boss Let, all the time. Because let me ask you, this, this hand in the face yeah. thing, Dave. Yeah, it, it, it makes me furious, you know. If I'm out in a crowd and I'm talking, say, for instance, I'm going over and I'm talking to, any twins in here? Yeah, we've got twins here. We've got twins there. Yeah, that's right. I'll talk to you, right? Okay. He comes straight along, right? He put his hand in my face like that, literally put his hand in my face, and take the conversation. If I still keep talking, he raises his voice and drowns me out. Oops, drowns me out of it, and I just can't I'm not take as bad. it. Really, you know, if I you look at him, and you're proving the minute that what it is, you see, I let him have his own way because otherwise we make silly fools of ourselves. But I do let him. Well, I think. Win. Well, the, the, do you find that you something? Let let win, you know what I mean? Can I just ask something? Which one of you was born first? Me. I was born an hour before Dave. Isn't it true, Dave, that that hour has really gone to his head? It has, and I, I've told her. It comes over. See, I don't know. Yeah, I, 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 I told my auntie about it. I said, honestly, well, she said, rub she always remember, she'd tell him it's rubbish before the broom. That's what she said to me. No, I said, I always say that to her. What I'm trying to say is, you twins must know. You know, if you're, if you're, if you're talking, you know, to each other, and, 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 and you're getting on about one thing and another, and you see something wrong about him, do you look at him and say, God, God, comb your hair, you're not He's right. always or, picking or, on you know, you've, you've got a spot on your face, it cover out. it up. Do you ever, you're very conscious, you think it's you you're looking at. Hang on, wait I a mean, second. I think that all the time, you know, I, I just... Let's hear from this lady over here. Um, Lynn, we've just met these twins just for, like, for five minutes and we can see as an audience what they're like and how they're just incredibly similar. <laughs> yes, Didn't you realise when you decided to marry them that they were going to be like this constantly? Because I can see how annoying they are, sorry. But yeah, well, <laughs> yeah, yeah, you yeah, don't let I each have a do. I'm a twin, my brother's over there. Oh, and right. I let oh, stand up your brother. Oh, there's your twin brother, right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I let him speak for himself and let him do what he wants to do, but those two, you just kind of act as one rather than as two. Didn't well, you realise? Oh, we can't help that, I don't yeah, think. See, I, I don't know about you two boys. Yes. You brought up with your own parents. You two. Yeah, we, well, we, we had the, the difference is with me. I'm a mum and I'm a dad to him. He's I've always mum been, and dad. I'm I've always been the dad. most... I've always said I'm more... more I'm not the more dominant, yes. but I, I seem to more protect him more, and he tries to override me. When he's wrong, you see, and you can't do well, that. You can't be bullied. Yes. I've done it when he was ten <laughs> upwards. We were slung in with our auntie and uncle, which just didn't really want any kids. And yeah, we but you brought up, you're brought up with your parents, so you've got love from can your I, parents. Can I just we put only you got on love from each other. For a second. So I can't get yeah, away sure, from him. Wait a minute. Hold. I'll hold you, then I'll rewind you. The moment you're on yeah. fast forward, uh, lady here. Um, can't you see what it's doing to your wife? Because with Dave, she's getting really upset that he's always there with you. Have you not got your life of your own, sort of thing? Because like. You're well, always yeah. with them if you've not got a wife and kids and family and Well, we have. Their friends. kids are here. Yes, where's that? Where's, um, <laughs> where are your kids? Are where's Jane and Lucy? Well, are they there? Where's my Jane and Lucy? Let Stand me up, come Jane over. Lucy. There's my Jane and Lucy. Let Stand me come. Jane and Lucy, let me come and see you. Right. Okay, right. Who's, who's which is... Okay. Wait, wait, wait. Min, that's Melanie, that's Dave's. Which is Lucy? My sister, Dan. Dan. Dan's, Dan's our dad. Daughter. You're Dan's kids, that's Dan yeah. there. And, and you're, I'm Dave's daughter. And you're Dave's daughter. Yeah. daughter. That's I'd just, Melanie. I'd just like to say, like, how special it is. Because, like, they're so close, and it brings us so close. Oh. And we're like brothers and sisters, all of us. Oh. And um, oh. it's just so special. Really? Because <laughs> everybody... <laughs> oh, really? <laughs> Would you, would you mind telling your fathers to sit down, please, and behave? Yeah, sit down, please. Sit down, it's, like, it's like having two dads. We've um, got two dads each. It's like...
There's never a dull moment in our lives, you know. It's always so hyperactive. And what, like, all of us are like it. Even my little seven-year-old yeah. brother, he's so hyperactive. He's worse yeah. than them two sometimes. Where's my son? Where's he? Oh, hello, David. You're, you're, who's, so you're, the you're Dave's boy. Yeah. Yeah. Like the... Then yours, what's it talking about? No idea. So then when I went to Eastbourne, I started doing karaoke and, and uh, cabaret, and Linda does the disco. We've got a great show there. And um, what happened one day... Thanks for the blush. I bought some diamond rings just to flash up, you know, when I'm on the stage. Look, Nothing to do look, with that. No, no copy. Yeah, Who's yeah, the copy? And wasn't there a Rolls Royce situation say, too? And the, the, the Melanie yes. say, well... Oh, Dad's got rings, and as if I've just copied him. <laughs> just a minute, I mean, Dan. Yeah. Just a minute. My uncle started taxiing once, and um, then my dad started taxiing. Yeah. But my uncle thought he was copying him. But what he didn't tell anyone is that he sold my dad the taxi. <laughs> 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 so you tell me now. I didn't know that. He sold my dad the taxi, so he obviously wanted my dad to do it. Else, he wouldn't have sold him the taxi. He, he, he didn't like, like it. Um, once, yeah, Dad really wanted a Rolls Royce. He really wanted to buy one. A second hand um, one, of course. Yeah, because yeah, yeah, uh, they really like them. And in the end, my, um, ambition. my uncle bought um, the Rolls Royce that he yeah. wanted. Dave, and he was driving around in it waving, and he wouldn't let we him have a ride in it. Ride and he gave up. I never if my dad had the car, had money, had if my dad had money, selfish. he would have brought two. He would have brought two and given him one. Let's just check in. Your dad is Dave, and your dad is Dad. Just checking this. Let's just take us back to this this caravan situation, because poor Linda. Linda's in this situation where she's in a caravan one, yeah. yes, with one right. twin. She yeah. opens the window, that's there's right. a mirror Can't image caravan yeah. Yeah. with a mirror yeah. image twin no, no. dressed identically right next door. She's yeah, a laughing stock of the yeah. whole caravan no, not side, really. right? Not yeah, really. Can I right. say something? Really, everybody wants the same, really. It's the contest. Well, it is, I suppose. But the thing is, uh, I didn't... Uh, <laughs> I don't look on it as a contest because I, w I, I want the same as him because I, I'm the same as him. Right. Yes, that isn't a matter of wanting to make him belittle him or belittle me, because I wouldn't do that to him, you know. No. I mean, no, but, I'd rather back down. We've heard that. from Dan, though, that he's yeah. the karaoke king. So let me ask you, Dave, what do you do for a living these days? He's copied, he does it now. Well, I, I do karaoke, it. but uh, <laughs> and, and well, he's, the he's, same, I'm really. the singer, and he's the harmony man. He's the harmony um, man. Uh, but I, I do it with my, my beautiful daughter down do there. You? Linda, she sings Linda, come on, you come all the way here. Get your get your in your ended edgewise. What do you want to say to Dave about everything? Well... Look at him, uh, look da at him. Dave, yes, I'm sorry, you know, I know you love your brother and, uh, and everything, you know, you want yeah. to be the same, obviously, yeah. you're the, the same, two people the same and everything, but <laughs> we've got to realise, you know, we've got to have our life together yeah. and, and get on with what we want to do, and uh, you get on with your yeah. life and obviously have well, a happy medium somewhere, uh, you know, and don't yeah. try to... Yeah, but it isn't, it isn't all my fault, you no. see, because I say, well, oh, I'm a, probably a bit softer mm -hmm. than he is. Oh. But, uh, <laughs> but, but, but the thing is, that's ridiculous. If I, when, I mean, you see, the thing is, what people out there don't realise, the twins do, right? You twins realise. The twins realise, but I mean, this is quite important, that I've never been depressed in my life, ever, me and him, all our life, and we are over 21. Okay, Never 22. <laughs> but the only yeah. time I've ever been depressed in my life is when he isn't on the scene. Dave, do you think Linda's got a point? She says, of course you're very close. She understands uh, that. He doesn't know. Hang on a minute. Hang on a minute. I'll put it, it to you all. this way. Maybe yeah. she's got a point, but listen to what I'm saying. If you, if you go out with a fellow that's got a dog, yes. is it love me, love my dog? Or do you not bother with it? That's the way it's got to be. Really. Oh, <laughs> I think so. I think so, really. oh. I think so. Oh. Linda arrived. I thought no, the most tremendous sympathy for Linda, but now I've met Dave. But it's well, love me, love my twin, isn't no, it? Well, Todd knows the best one, doesn't he, boys? Boys and girls. Let me hear from your son over there. Who's son are you? 
I'm Dave's. Dave's, Dave's son. son, right. Yeah, back to the that, costume. Well, when we was children, my dad bought us a black cat when we was about ten. And the next week, what happened? Big had to buy a blacker one, didn't he? <laughs> <laughs> it's the same all the way down the line. They both copy each other because they're so identical. What do you call it? Well, we call them Big and Little. Was one oh, you call them Big and Little? Oh, oh, it's sweet. nothing to do with yeah. uh, uh, that. That was when we was born. This yeah. twin here. Was born for obvious reasons. <laughs> Being a twin, I understand how um, Dave and Dan are. Because Stand up, twin. <laughs> because He's we've always him. been brought up separately and as two different people, but we like the same things. We go to the s we go to Durham Hockey Club together. We go to band together. Um, and we have the same group of friends, and it's not because, you know, that's the way Mum brought us up, who's sitting there. <laughs> oh, you're the mum! <laughs> Scott, stand oh, up! They're lovely, lovely. they're she a critic. Always the mum, that's all I can say there. Yeah. Can you imagine them growing up and living lives a bit like this, kind of, you know, joined at the hip, basically? Well, I would like to think that they'll, they'll be good friends, but I want them to be themselves. Yes. But they seem very, just very similar, naturally. They, yeah, they are similar. Friends. You want yeah. to be happy, you though, don't you? Be happy. And we if they're went, together, we they will to be happy together, and they're going to have their own we friends. Like, so. We're really good friends. We have the same group of friends, which is the same as you. You like the same things, and that's why the, that's, that's why they're like they are, because they like the same things. They've been brought up with the same Correct. things, good and girl. you can't 100%. change that. You can't no, say to you. As far as you're concerned, Linda's going to have to learn to live with it, right? Mm, yeah, yeah, you can't yeah. change the way they are. You no, married him for what he is, and you can't that. change love it. Love me, love my realize. twin. After the break, more yeah. twins who fight like cat and dog, and the mum who's sick to death of them. Don't go away. <laughs> Your final word. Right. Well, my auntie May Sit. said. <laughs> my auntie May. My auntie May said we yeah. used to be. I'm one of his boys, right? I'm playing for years. But she I upset him by saying I was she, the best player. And she listen. told all the neighbours <laughs> and everybody he's better than me. <laughs>